I don't even know how to do an intro for this. Just clear your calendar, get these ingredients, make this zero car pizza now. Preheat oven to 350 degrees. You're gonna find out why this pizza crust is a fat burner with our first ingredient, which is goat cheese. Goat cheese has two times more MCT than that of cow, and the importance of that MCT is, oh my goodness, it keeps us full. Now I'm probably gonna have a snarky little comment that's gonna say, oh, well, why you don't just add MCT oil or coconut oil? Um, guess what, I don't like the flavor of it, but, but I love goat cheese. It is so neutral, and what I mean by that, it takes on the flavor of the product. So so go ahead and try it. I got it at the Kroger because y'all know I'm bougie on a bayou. I don't like to spend them lots of money. It is two ounces of goat cheese. Y'all saw I did not do this fancy schmancy measurement because I'm not a fancy schmancy kitchen. Goat cheese also has A2 beta casing, which is great for digestion. So many folks are lactose intolerant. My husband lactose intolerant and still eat cheese and complain of tummy troubles. And we're going to go ahead and add one and a half cup of our shredded cheddar. You can see that I got this at the Kroger and go ahead and microwave this for one minute. We removed our fat burning goat cheese and shredded cheddar from the microwave. Go ahead and grab that fork. I mean, if you want to grab some fancy piece of equipment, that's fine. And give it a little mix. To this, add your one cup of almond flour. And of course, you can find it at all your stores, even the Walmart, one of my favorites. Start to combine this. Add to this a teaspoon of Italian seasoning. For some reason, my camera didn't show it, so you can get that Italian seasoning pretty much anywhere. Go ahead and grab your parchment paper and your rolling pen because we need to roll or smash this out as thin as possible. Now, I am a thin crust fan. Comment below, what are you? Thin crust versus thick crust because, gang, <laughs> thin crust right here. I guess you can make it thicker. Go for it. Try it. Let me know how it comes out. And the other thing I want to tell you all is please please be sure to add your favorite seasonings to this. You know, we are not glued to just Italian seasoning and I don't want you to feel glued to these recipes that you have to do it so exact. It drives me bonkos when I see recipes with not only 10 ingredients and also the life story. Comment below, I don't like a life story. If you are sick of reading all these recipes that tells the entire life story, honey, just give me the recipe, boo. I don't want to hear your life story. You can see I'm on the struggle bus a little bit with this and our parchment paper, but you can also see that gorgeous old pan that I know. I think that pan's older than me. Y'all know y'all got some corn and wear in y'all cabinets. Let me know if you do because that is the best. There is nothing better than old equipment because it works like nobody's business. Now again, gang, you, you can use a rolling pin. You can kind of see I'm using my fingers. The point is we want to get a perfectly thin crust. Bring that crust to that oven, cook it for 12 minutes. Now, this isn't the full time that it's cooked. We still have to add the toppings and I wanted to keep today's pizza really simple. I just did some pizza sauce. Now I'm using Classico. You could definitely use Rayo's, which is super popular on keto forms. I sprinkled a little bit of cheese on this. And again, if you want to add onions and peppers and different meats, and if you're ketovore and if you're all that stuff, please add what you want to add. And I want to know how it turns out. This is a community. I love you all. And I want to hear what you do and bring it back to the oven for about 10 minutes. Let it cook. We're opening up. We see that cheese melts and, and gang if you spent your time laughing i forgot to write down the recipe scroll in the comments and for more low carbon laughter let's lose some weight and lower those blood sugars be sure to subscribe to my channel much love gang